What's the key to successful change management mm -hmm. in organizations? Mm -hmm. Successful change management, I think, starts with knowing the markets that you're in. So I'm, I'm thinking of one of my colleagues who's a co-author in the book, Christy Caldwell. Uh, she lives in Shanghai and woke up one morning and decided that she needed a new oven in her apartment. And so she went online on that Sunday morning about 11 o'clock and ordered her oven and paid by debit card and then was asked how soon she would like it. Um, would she like it same day? Yes, thank you very much. Uh, Three o'clock in the afternoon, that sounds good. So within four hours on a Sunday, a group of workers were bringing the oven up the mm -hmm. stairs to her apartment, up four flights of stairs to her apartment. There was no extra charge and she had the oven installed that same day. Christy had previously lived in the UK and her comment, with no offense to my uh, friends and colleagues in the UK, <laughs> was that it would have taken more than a week. Uh, she would have had to go pick it up from a neighboring store, would have had to pay double the price, the oven to actually have it delivered, and then to deliver it up the small three steps or stair steps from her garden, she would have had to thank the workers very much and to invite them for tea. <laughs> so <laughs> a different system with uh, many charms of its own, but. Um, if you're really trying to manage change within an organization, you have to understand the exact circumstances of the market and the, the bar for the competition. So mm. if you are, for example, trying to sell consumer goods in a city on the east coast of China, that's the bar for competition online ordering, same day delivery at a very, very reasonable price. And as a customer, you feel pretty good about that. Yeah. So that's the, the kind of competitive environment that you have to work in.